my dog just put up in the shop to get these joints going. So we're about to put them handlebars up on this Road King. Now this is a bike I got from Copart and I got it for my, uh, I got it for a flip and ended up flipping it to my boy. He ended up getting it, he went down on it. So um, after he went down, he basically was trying to get it back going. So I told him I'll help you out and get it back going. So we went ahead and went with the paint, uh, paint and powder coat, did everything, but I'll keep it a thousand. I think I'm taking too long for my boy. So I told him, so, um, I'm about to go ahead and just put all the pieces on for my boy. I got almost everything except for a few little things. I know off the top of my head, like a, a rear brake line and uh, rotors, a couple little things he missing. So I told him I'm gonna just go ahead, put everything that I have and I'm gonna just give him the bike. So we're gonna go ahead and put what we can on. I know I can't put this on, I have no spacers. This bag is still missing the other bag, like the latch. A lot of little stuff, so I definitely gotta uh, get held back from that, but it's not my problem. Like I said, if you want me to throw everything that I have on my hand, so I'm gonna do that, and I should have this bike done, if not today, then tomorrow. So it'll be fully complete on the way to the owner and I'm gonna let him deal with it, I guess. But we about to throw these parts on y'all, so stay tuned, let's get it. how aggressive these bars look on this bike. It gives the whole bike a different look. Top of these little parts, so let's get back to it, man. So I went ahead and put a few things on. I just let the grips on. You'll really mess your head or your eye up walking around these bikes. So like I was just saying, I went and got a few of the pieces on, got the little brake, um, got the bars on, putting these little uh, highway pegs on. We got the Arlen shifters on there looking good. Go swap this thing out next. But we got it going, putting these little pieces on. We're gonna replace that with this, little contrast cut. But yeah, we're about to put that other highway peg on there so everything can finish matching and flowing. So stay tuned. And it's definitely looking a lot much better than it just was. Once I put the gas tank and everything else back on, but these little pieces and accessories does make a little bit of difference, man. So let's keep it going. And see, with this bike stuff, excuse me with my hair, I know I look crazy, but I ain't tripping. But on another note, with this bike stuff, it's like, 
I try to give everybody the benefit of the doubt because everybody don't even know about the bike that they ride. Some people think they do until you really bust it down and you start giving them the game on what's behind the job of the bike. So what I mean by that is, a lot of these things I tell people, you get this, you get that, boom. Some people want to find it somewhere else for cheaper. When you begin doing that, I begin to back away because not even about the money, just for the simple fact, you're making it difficult on me when I know what's gonna work versus people buying the wrong thing and then not end up having stuff. So that stuff is a headache, but it's part of the game. So I try to prevent it as much as possible. If it happens, it happens, we go just go from there. This thing is looking a lot much better. There are a lot of things that I would definitely like to change, like uh, needs to get a black one of these. This one is old and damaged. I told him, he said, throw it on there. So. I'm gonna throw it on there while the bike is getting ready to go back to him. Also need another one of these black light brackets. I will not leave that chrome one on. And along with this exhaust, this is supposed to be coming off and replacing it with the black one. I don't know how that's gonna come out, but that's something that I would definitely do. And then I'm gonna black this last piece out. And then it'll be on its way. So stay tuned, we getting it going. It's looking a lot much better. Also, I received all the emails, just give me some time. I've been working, moving around crazy and everything for my birthday. So I'm gonna get back to those emails tonight. I'll start responding and I'll reply in a timely manner from the order they was received to me. So just bear with me, please. But like I said the other video, I'm trying to get all these bikes out so I can be on to the next and keep it going and be on the road. We almost there though, we working and we getting there. We almost got the Bro King right here, the blue one. This one is headed to Wisconsin. That one should be done, I'll say in the next two to three weeks max. And it should be on its way just with the last little pieces that I'm waiting on. But we got it going though, it's looking good. This thing definitely looking good. My dog over there chilling. But yeah, man, we got this thing looking good. This one is looking a lot much better than it was. I'll put a picture up from the before so you guys can get a glimpse if you haven't seen when I picked this up from San Bernardino Copart. But on another note, we still have the custom Harley Davidson Street Glide giveaway right here. This is a 2009 Street Glide. Now I have it took apart because it is going through its phase. As you can see, I already put the blacked out legs and the cans back on there. I got the bars on its way to the bike. I got a few of the motor pieces already blacked out, the primary, the horn, the back head cover. I got the front one and powder coat. I'm gonna grab that probably tomorrow. But I just wanted to take this one to uh, the frame doctor like I did the first one, just so I know the body is completely straight and nothing to talk about. So I just wanna make sure everybody's safe and sound. With the winner of the bike, we haven't won it yet. We still have about 60, almost 70 tickets left on the uh, slide and mass. So, if you haven't got you one, get you one, man. Enter the chance to win a bike. You can literally be just like these bikes out here, man. Fully bust down from the bars to the wheels and that nice paint job, man. So I'm telling you guys, if you could get you a slider mask, you're only gonna be happy in the end. This is not a scam, none of that stuff. We're giving some back to the people, some customized and different one of one at that. So you get to pick the color by choice. That way you don't have to get a bike and then try to save up your money and paint it the way you want it. You can have it freshly painted the color you want from the jump and get it dropped off right to your door. So if you haven't already, man, please, please go in the description below and get you a sliding mask, man. You'll love it. And so will I, man. You'll have a built by Dre bike in your town sliding. It's like the rest of these bikes on this way, man. So stay tuned, man. We working, we getting it in. Y'all see what's going on. But yeah, man, it's getting late. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, get back to this thing tomorrow. We're gonna finish putting all these little pieces on here. Really just the throttle cables, the brake line, clutch line, and floorboards, and these little brackets. We're gonna put that on and we'll be done. Our job will be done. We'll have everything complete. That last little piece powder coated. I'm not putting the exhaust back on because he said he's going with something different, which is cool because it will be blacked out. So we're gonna go from there, but the main job is done. Literally, it's all done. It was crash, damage, salvage title, completely done. I would have left the bike how I was and never messed with it. But when there's Dre, there is a way. I'm telling you, this bike is transformed. I don't care who don't like it. I know that I like it and the owner loves it. If he like it, I love it. That's all I need. Just like it is, man. This thing is transforming, guys. So stay tuned, man. It's coming, man. It's definitely coming. Looking good. 
But yeah, we about to slide out, man. It's getting late. My dog over here ready to go, huh, Ace? Yeah. He ready to go slide, so we about to get to it, man. Getting this work in. Like I said before, man, like, comment, subscribe, and please grab you a slider mask if you haven't done that yet. So tune in and check it out and enter to win. It could be your lucky day. So let's get it, man. Y'all see what's going on.